Welcome to this Franklin Public School screencast. In this screencast, we're going to look at Safari and how to set your home page. So here I am in Safari. The home page of your browser was set to empty page by default, meaning just a blank white page would show up. How you can change that is you go up to the Safari dropdown and you go to Preferences. When you go into Preferences, there's all these different choices at the top. We're on the General tab. And if you notice here, it says New Windows Open With. And like I said, this was set to empty page. And there's some other choices in here that we'll go over in some other video screencasts. But for this screencast, let's just set this to the home page. So now, whenever I launch Safari or I open a new window in Safari, whatever is set in this home page line is what will show up, whatever web address, whatever website. So right now that's set to google.com in this, in this instance. Let's say I wanted to set that to my login or to the area where I log in for email. You probably check email pretty often. What if you want this to be the web page? The best way to do this is to go to that page in the browser, which I just did, go back up to Safari, Preferences, and now I can set under this home page line, there's a button It says set to current page. If I click that, it takes whatever address of the page I'm at and it automatically fills it in. So now I close that and it's set, so let's test this here. If I close my window and I go back and I click on Safari, and this will be this way unless I change it, it automatically goes to the email login for the district. So that is how you set your home page. You can set the home page to whatever you like. This was just a suggestion. Some people were asking how to get to the email quicker, and, and that's a suggestion to set your home page to the email login screen. Thanks so much for watching.